giant phallus shaped iceberg floating in Conception Bay surprises residents of Dildo, Canada. And then it shows a picture of exactly what they yeah. promised the show. Look at look at the ad above it with the girl looking down and it says bike <laughs> defender. It's like, well, I hope so. <laughs> oh, bit defender, sorry. Either works. Yeah, either one's uh, fine. Yeah, what a foul li- what a, that's a hell of a foul lice. Uh, <laughs> oh my god, hold on a second. It says a penis-shaped iceberg floating by the town of Dildo, Canada, which isn't too far from the city of Spread Eagle. What? And the town of <laughs> Shut up. Placentia. This can't, what? So they're fucked up up there. <laughs> they are fucked up up there. First this- of all, who let Olaf get a handful of Viagra, huh? <laughs> Let it grow. Let it grow. <laughs> yeah. This is his tiny body's under the water in this picture. This is the weapon that Mr. Freeze didn't use much. <laughs> they were like, look, Arnold, we can't fit this in a fucking speedo. <laughs> wow. Uh, Shout out to the photographer, Kenny Pretty, who, uh, who posted this so people can see it? <laughs> Ken, Ken Pretty, and it's in a uh, uh where I did just scroll by. It's in Conception Bay. Yes, <laughs> <laughs> Conception Bay. There it is, right there. Wow. When Olaf met Elsa, they named it that. <laughs> what, uh, uh, the- perhaps unsurprisingly, the Dicky Berg. <laughs> oh come on, Canada! You can do better than that. I mean, for yeah, Christ's sake, on, guys. Wait. Well, that's what the locals are calling it. First of all, the locals, they live near an iceberg. Yeah. How how uh, how are you even putting words together? What's going on up there? <laughs> the oh, least, don't you know, the Dickyberg. The least funny person got to the news first. <laughs> that's what happened. I mean, <laughs> yeah. there's so much better than the Dickyberg. Yeah. yeah. Well, there's two people competing. That's the problem. <laughs> <laughs> I mean... There you know, know the, the uh the uh most impressive Whoa. thing is that you know it's able to stay hard in the cold water. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, really broke that uh that what do you call it? Um myth. Well, Stigma. It's, it's 30 feet and when it's, it's cold balls. out. I can't imagine <laughs> I can't imagine how big Christ. it is. Oh my god. Warm. Yeah, put it in the uh <laughs> I'll collapse the next day. Oh no. Well yeah, it's its ex-wife showed up, and then. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, baseball season started, so. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it drank too much. The Oilers <laughs> lost in the playoffs. <laughs> right down the shitter. Somebody tried to go whiskeying on it. <laughs> wow. You could do some hell of a wake ballsing out there. I'll tell you that. <laughs> wow. What the hell's going on in Canada? Yeah, that thing, it's a... It ripped a fucking 40-foot schooner. <laughs> wow. uh, the Titanic ran into it, and uh, he's being charged with... <laughs> Fuck, dildo ice, and I wonder if this guy was this was this cat. What was his name? Kenny Pretty. Yeah. Yes. What is he, what's he an AEW? What kind of name is this? <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> Fuck yeah, dude. fucking. Well, gorgeous George a, took a picture of this fucking iceberg. <laughs> see, it's a, he's a drag queen, but as we know, fucking up in Canada, they, they give the worst <laughs> nicknames to everything. Yes. Yeah. They now call him Dickie Berg. <laughs> that's, a, that's a drag name. What a yeah. First of all, trans trans people would not be happy with it. You know how much it is to get. It's probably a lot of money to get a regular trans operation, but certainly getting a thirty foot fucking iceberg removed is not. Gonna be yeah, <laughs> they're not tucking that away, are they? Hell no. <laughs> Holy oh. shit. He's now. Uh, they broke him up, and he's now making a bunch of. Cocktails. Hey. <laughs> hey. Hey. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh. <laughs> I mean, 
it is an aggressive word, cocktail, isn't it? Though yeah. the women yeah. in Canada are viciously fighting against global warming right now because of this. <laughs> this is a new angle for global warming. They're like, look, you want all these dick icebergs to go away? Stop fucking running your yeah. car for no reason. Yeah, you jerk offs. This is why Greta got involved in the first place. <laughs> Her name's Greta Thun Iceberg. <laughs> Does that tell they're, you anything? They're putting, sh- <laughs> they're putting on a show now called Magic Ike. <laughs> <laughs> We're Canadians. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I wonder if they could, you could probably carve something like this out and, and make it an igloo and make it like an Airbnb Ooh. destination place. Yeah, I mean, it's a dick house. <laughs> house. <laughs> it's my. They icing. got that playing underneath. <laughs> it, heads up, all you Torontos, we got a dick house for you. Oh uh, yeah, Ontario, ho, here we come. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to say anything, but Prince Edward Island's walking with a bit of a limp. Just saying. <laughs> <laughs> Just an ob- observation. You're going to love this one, all you Toronto blue gays. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Wow. They are extremely happy this week. Oh, yeah. Wow. That's uh, the Montreal Expos <laughs> new mascot. <laughs> Bring back the team now. They're like, perfect. We, they're bringing back the team. They're like, can we get a 120 foot trench coat made in a week? <laughs> they're gonna. They're actually touring this. Don't around. you know a guy? They're gonna. It's gonna be outside the Winnipeg Jets game. <laughs> time has uh how much time has prolapsed i mean elapsed since i've last seen you dicky berg <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>